did you know? Nepal is the oldest country in South Asia, and they have their signature weapon, the Kukuri. In this continuation of the Nepal series, we'll take you on a journey to explore the 50 more unknown facts about Nepal that make it one of the most fascinating countries in the world. Trust me, you didn't see this coming. So without wasting your time, let's dive right in. Number 50, National Flag Geometry. Nepal's national flag is the only non-rectangular national flag in the world. The crimson-red background symbolizes bravery, while the blue borders represent peace. Number 49, birthplace of the Buddha's mother. Devdaha in the Rupandehi district of Nepal is believed to be the maternal home of Maya Devi, the mother of Siddhartha Gautama, who later became known as Lord Buddha. Number 48, living with the Yeti spirit. Nepal embraces the Yeti legend, not just as a myth, but also as a symbol of conservation. The Sagarmatha National Park has the Yeti Trail, attracting adventurers and conservationists alike. Number 47, the mysterious Lepcha people. The Lepcha, an indigenous group in eastern Nepal, have a rich cultural heritage with their unique language and rituals. Their history adds an intriguing layer to Nepal's diverse ethnic tapestry. Number 46, connecting the Terai to the mountains. The Terai region, known for its flat plains, is not just a transition zone. It's a vital part of Nepal's agricultural belt, connecting the Himalayas to the lowlands and playing a crucial role in the country's economy. Number 45, the Annapurna Sanctuary. Nepal hosts the Annapurna Sanctuary, a natural amphitheater surrounded by towering peaks, providing trekkers with a surreal experience. This sanctuary is not just a physical space, but also a cultural and spiritual haven. Number 44, the Rani Pokhari Heritage. Rani Pokhari, an ancient artificial pond in Kathmandu, dates back to the 17th century. Its tranquil waters and historic significance make it a hidden gem within the bustling city. Number 43, the mystery of Kirateshwar Mahadev. Kirateshwar Mahadev, a revered temple in the Eastern Hills, is dedicated to Lord Shiva. Legend has it that Lord Shiva disguised himself as a Kirti to marry goddess Parvati, adding a mythical touch to this sacred site. Number 42, the charms of Bandipur. Nepal's well-preserved cultural gem, Bandipur, offers a step back in time with its preserved architecture and panoramic views. This town reflects the beauty of Nepal's rural life. Number 41, the legacy of Gandruk. Gandruk, a picturesque village in the Annapurna region, is not just known for its stunning vistas, but also for its rich Gurung culture, traditional houses, and warm hospitality. Number 40, the sacred Bintia Basini Temple. Bintia Basini Temple in Pohara is a significant Hindu pilgrimage site. Its location, overlooking the city and the Annapurna Range, adds a spiritual dimension to the panoramic views. Number 39, the intricate art of Pauba paintings. Nepal boasts a unique art form called Pauba paintings. These intricate, hand-painted scrolls depict religious and cultural themes, showcasing the skill and craftsmanship of Nepali artists. Number 38, oldest country in South Asia. Nepal is often referred to as one of the oldest nations in the region due to its long-standing history and cultural heritage. Number 37, the exquisite handicrafts of Bhaktapur. Bhaktapur, one of the ancient cities in the Kathmandu Valley, is renowned for its exquisite handicrafts. The city's Durbar Square is a living museum of intricate woodwork, pottery, and metal craft showcasing the artistic brilliance of the local craftsmen. Number 36, the Tengboche. Tengboche, situated in the Everest region, is home to the Tengboche Monastery, 
a spiritual hub with awe-inspiring views of Mount Everest and its neighboring peaks. The monastery hosts the colorful Mani Rimdu Festival, attracting devotees and trekkers alike. Number 35, the Transcendent Panchas. Panchas, a less explored trekking destination near Pokhara, offers a panoramic spectacle of the Annapurna and Daulagiri mountain ranges. Its tranquility and lush landscapes provide a serene retreat for nature enthusiasts. Number 34, the Salt Trading Route. The historic salt trading route, connecting Tibet and India, passes through the Mustang region of Nepal. This ancient trade route has played a pivotal role in shaping the cultural exchange between these regions. Number 33, the Tharu Community. The Tharu people, indigenous to the Terai region, have a rich cultural heritage. Known for their unique customs, traditional dances, and distinctive lifestyle, the Tharu community adds vibrancy to Nepal's cultural mosaic. Number 32, the Sweta Mahendra Cave. Sweta Mahendra Cave, located in Pokhara, holds religious significance for Hindus. The cave houses a sacred pond and a shrine dedicated to Lord Shiva, attracting pilgrims seeking spiritual solace. Number 31, the Honey Hunters of Nepal. In the cliffs of central Nepal, Gurung honey hunters practice an ancient tradition of harvesting wild honey from Himalayan cliffs. This perilous yet fascinating practice has been passed down through generations. Number 30, the Kali Gandaki Gorge. The Kali Gandaki Gorge, one of the deepest gorges globally, carves its way through the Annapurna and Daulagiri mountain ranges. The juxtaposition of towering peaks and the amazing river creates a dramatic landscape that captivates the imagination. Number 29, the Muktinath. Muktinath, located at an altitude of 3,710 meters, is a sacred pilgrimage site for both Hindus and Buddhists. The temple's unique setting amidst snow-capped mountains and natural springs creates a spiritually charged atmosphere. Number 28, the Tansen. Tansen, perched on the hills of Palpa, is a town that reflects a harmonious blend of Nepali, Tibetan, and Indian cultures. Known for its medieval architecture and vibrant markets, Tansen adds a unique flavor to the cultural tapestry of Nepal. Number 27, the Caves of Siddha Gufa. Siddha Gufa, located in the Bandipur region, is the largest cave in Nepal and one of the deepest in South Asia. Exploring its caverns adorned with stalactites and stalagmites provides an otherworldly experience. Number 26, the oldest temple in Kathmandu. Changu Narayan, dedicated to Lord Vishnu, is the oldest Hindu temple in the Kathmandu Valley. Its exquisite wood carvings and ancient sculptures showcase the artistic prowess of the Lachavi period. Number 25, the birthplace of Tenzing Norgay. Tengboche, in the Everest region, is not only renowned for its monastery, but is also the birthplace of Tenzing Norgay, one of the first two men to reach the summit of Mount Everest alongside Sir Edmund Hillary. Number 24, the unique Gurung culture. The Gurung community, predominantly found in the Annapurna and Manaslu regions, boasts a distinct culture and language. The annual Mani Rimdu festival, celebrated with traditional dances, masks, and rituals, is a testament to their vibrant heritage. Number 23, the Museum of Panaudi. Panaudi, a historical town in the Kathmandu Valley, serves as a living cultural museum with its well-preserved architecture, intricately carved temples, and the confluence of sacred rivers. Number 22, the Forest of Pathibhara. Pathibhara, a sacred pilgrimage site in eastern Nepal, is not only known for its temple, but also for the surrounding forest that is believed to be protected by the deity. The tranquil ambiance adds a spiritual dimension to the pilgrimage experience. 
Number 21, the cultural tapestry of Heil. Heil, a quaint town in the Eastern Hills, showcases a diverse cultural tapestry with influences from various ethnic communities. Its strategic location along trekking routes adds vibrancy to its local markets and gatherings. Number 20, the Newars of Bungamati. Bungamati, a traditional Newar village near Kathmandu, preserves the cultural heritage of the Newar community. The craftsmanship, especially in woodwork and metalwork, reflects the artistic legacy of the region. Number 19, the Cave of Maratika. Maratika Cave, also called Halesi Mahadev in the Kotang district, is a sacred pilgrimage site. According to legend, both Guru Padmasambhava and Mandarava achieved immortality here, making it highly revered among Buddhists. Number 18, the beauty of Gokyo Lakes. While Gosai Kunda is famous, Gokyo Lakes, situated in the Everest region, offer a captivating alternative. Surrounded by snow-capped peaks, these pristine glacial lakes reflect the stunning beauty of Nepal's high-altitude landscapes. Number 17, the Mala Dynasty. The Mala era, which ruled Nepal's Kathmandu Valley from the 12th to the 18th century, left behind an architectural legacy. Durbar squares in Kathmandu, Bhaktapur, and Patan showcase the intricate craftsmanship of this bygone dynasty. Number 16, the diversity of indigenous costumes. The various ethnic groups in Nepal showcase a vibrant array of traditional costumes, each reflecting the unique identity of its community. From the elaborate attire of Tamangs to the distinctive hats of the Limbus, the diversity is visually striking. Number 15, the craftsmanship of Kukuri. The Kukuri, a traditional Nepali knife, is not just a weapon, but a symbol of bravery and honor. Craftsmen meticulously handcraft these blades, each with its unique design, making it an iconic part of Nepali culture. Number 14, the origin of Araniko. Araniko, a legendary artist and architect, played a pivotal role in shaping Nepali art and culture. Hailing from the Kathmandu Valley, Araniko's influence extended to China, where his contributions are celebrated to this day. Number 13, the Fawa Lake. Fawa Lake in Pokhara is not just a picturesque water body, it's a hub of activities and cultural experiences. The reflection of the Annapurna Range on the calm waters and the vibrant lakeside atmosphere make it a must-visit destination. Number 12, the serenity of Rani Mahal. Rani Mahal, nestled on the banks of the Kali Gandaki River, is a hidden gem. Once a palace for the queen, it stands as a testament to the architectural grandeur of the past. This tranquil palace offers a unique blend of history and natural beauty. Number 11, the Langtang. Langtang National Park often referred to as the Valley of Glaciers, not only showcases breathtaking landscapes, but is also home to diverse flora and fauna. Red pandas, Himalayan tar, and various orchid species thrive in this pristine environment. Number 10, the Nuar Calligraphy. The Nuar community in the Kathmandu Valley has a unique form of calligraphy known as Prachalit Lipi. This ancient script, often used for religious texts and inscriptions, reflects the cultural richness of the Nuar civilization. Number 9. The Himalayan Republic Nepal is the world's only Hindu kingdom, turned secular republic sandwiched between two giants, India and China, and is home to eight of the world's 14 highest peaks, including Kanchanjanga, the third highest mountain globally. Number 8. The Tradition of Shamanism Shamanism, an ancient spiritual practice, is alive and well in various ethnic communities of Nepal. Shamans, known as Jankris, play a vital role in healing rituals and connecting communities with the spiritual realm. Number 7. 
the Trans-Himalayan trade routes. Nepal's strategic location made it a hub for Trans-Himalayan trade routes connecting India and Tibet. The ancient salt trade, wool, and other goods traversed through Nepal, influencing the cultural exchange along these routes. Number six, the Annapurna Base Camp. Annapurna Base Camp, surrounded by towering peaks, is a trekker's paradise. The journey to this base camp not only offers breathtaking views, but also provides insights into the local culture of the Gurung community. Number five, the King Prithvi Narayan Shah. King Prithvi Narayan Shah, the architect of modern Nepal, unified the small kingdoms into a single nation in the 18th century. His vision and leadership laid the foundation for the Nepal we know today. Number four, the metal crafts in Kirtapur. Kirtapur, a small town southwest of Kathmandu, is renowned for its metal craftsmanship. Local artisans create exquisite metalwork, including traditional utensils and decorative items, preserving a centuries-old craft that adds to Nepal's cultural richness. Number three, traditional music and dance. Nepal's rich cultural diversity is vividly expressed through traditional music and dance. Each ethnic group has its distinctive styles, whether it's the energetic Tharu stick dance or the graceful Nuwari classical music. Number two, the Swayambhu Nath. Swayambhu Nath, also known as the Monkey Temple, is an ancient stupa perched atop a hill in the Kathmandu Valley. Its unique architecture and the spiritual ambiance of the site have earned it recognition as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Number one, religious harmony. Nepal is a unique example of religious harmony with Hinduism and Buddhism coexisting seamlessly. Temples and stupas stand side by side, reflecting a shared spiritual heritage that transcends religious boundaries. As we conclude this exploration of 50 more unique facts about Nepal, we hope these insights have deepened your appreciation for the cultural, historical, and natural wonders that make Nepal truly exceptional. Click here and watch the first part and the most liked video about Nepal. I'll see you there.